Let's get your morning sports, but let's wait on the highlights for just a second. Let's talk about the party because this is the moment we've been building to all morning. And Bill is back. As you'll recall, he was away because he had a four day stag. Most guys have a bachelor party, but yours was four days. Go big or go home. <laughs> uh, go big or go home. It was fun. It was maybe Charlie Sheen fun, but it was, uh, it was right up there. We were talking about having tiger blood. Uh, I say I'm, I'm winning. I'm winning here. I'm winning there. You know, I don't want to go all Charlie Sheen on you, but it was a lot of fun. It was a good time. Uh, Montreal. Four days in Montreal. Uh, if you saw some guy roaming around in a Tarzan costume, I don't. Even, I don't know if that's the picture you're going to show us, but you, you have some photographic evidence here. I have a tame photo. I can't tell you where the photo's from. If you're from Montreal, you might okay. know the background. But uh, I'm going to rattle off the names here. If I can do that okay, real quick, I'm sure. going to do their nicknames. Just I don't want to give the names away here. I'm going left to right. We got Jooms, a situation, Tabor, Susta, which is my brother. Uh, it's myself, Cop, Alu, and Lucenza. These are all names that they just came up with <laughs> on the weekend. Uh, they're gonna love it that I put them on TV. Oh, yeah. it is, that's not that's Place des Arts. That's a cultural institution. I'm sure that's where you that's are. That's actually a museum, Heather. Yes. Um, <laughs> I'm sure. Late, late at nights, we'd go out to museums and churches and things like that, and just uh, check out the scene of Montreal. Higher, but, higher culture. Yes, and, and you know the funny thing is these guys are all from the West, and I told them to come out to Montreal because they haven't seen it before. I've heard the party was good, and I said, you know, it's great though. We can go out during the day, check it out, check out the city. They didn't see the daylight. I mean, we just yeah. we, 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 we woke up at about three. You went to about six or whatever it was, and then you slept all day again. So it's a place to do it. Yeah. Charlie Sheen light. June the 25th, <laughs> incidentally, is Nabil's big day. So we'll talk about that. Thanks for sharing. Thank you. All right. Curling highlights. Let's get to those next. We'll jump from stags to curling. Oh, okay. Let's try to make the jump here. So when you think of the bra, you think of Kevin Martin. He's dominated the tournament over the last few years. Sweeping in 2008 and 2009, he had a 30-game win streak at the tournament, going to yesterday's match with Brad Gushu. How did he do? Well, it's a big game for, or a big match for curling fans here. Curling uh, Kevin Martin representing Alberta. Brad Gushu playing for Newfoundland Labrador. Second end Martin attempting the draw. It's heavy, a rare gaff by the Alberta skip. Newfoundland steals two and is up by three. Eighth end, Gushu with the hammer. Look at this shot, a nice tap to count three. Martin concedes, and Newfoundland winning 9-4. Kevin Martin's 30-game win streak is now a thing of the past. Let's move over to the NHL. It's a battle for first in the southeast is Tampa hosting Washington. Ovechkin, St. Louis both making an impact in this one. First period, Bolts on the power play. St. Louis with the wrist shot. Sean Bergenheim redirects it past Michael Neuverth. 1-0 for the home team. Braden Holpe had to come in for Neuverth because of an injury. And then possibly makes the save of the year. Unbelievable stick save there. Robbing Simone Gagne, this one will go to the shootout where Alex Ovechkin plays hero. Caps win 2-1, and that's your look at sports.